Oh, I got her. I got <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my gosh. What happened to Jungle Space? Happy birthday. Damn, she will bring her home. Hey good trimmers, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to see you guys again. It's been a very long time. It's been about a month and a half and so much has been going on here in Toronto. We have Super Emma's debut guys. I never thought that was going to happen until recently and I am super stoked because I'm wearing Super M merch and all thanks to a special friend that lives in the US who decided to purchase this for me and we did our whole little transfer thing. But shout out to you girl, you are the best Chris. Um, without you I don't think I would have been able to dog get these shirts and look this fly already for Super M's debut within such short time. So hats off for you girl. And secondly I want to say happy birthday to me, happy birthday to me and Juhan, happy birthday to us. So for those guys who don't know, it's actually past my birthday, technically. My birthday was October 6th, and so was Juhan's, and I wasn't here. I was actually in the U.S. So I had the time of my life in the U.S., and there were some things that I wanted to share with you guys, and I'm going to do that in this video right now, and it all has to do with all 100% about K-pop. I promise you guys. Let's get into the juicy, great stuff. Finally, um... Monday after my birthday, I went to Manhattan because I really 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 wanted to visit the bookstore And if you guys know what bookstore it is, it's in Koreatown And this bookstore, I tell you, I go year to year there When I mean year to year, every time I visit, it's a must I always go there now because I get to get all my albums But the only problem is they're in US dollars and they're quite expensive Never mind that, you still get a wide variety of albums to be honest because sometimes it's super hard to get these albums and when you do get them you know what I mean it's either it takes forever because of shipping but because I'm going there and coming back I can't afford to bring it in my suitcase so your girl did a lot of lot of shopping I remind you I spent 263 US dollars which is almost 300 Canadian dollars on albums and maybe three pins and a pop socket and oh by the way i forgot to tell you this my mom she bought a red velvet keychain i'm like mom do you even know who red velvet is she listens to k-pop don't get me wrong she's like i don't know red velvet girl i saw them cp24 when they were in canada i'm like mom really when she's like they had a concert i'm like Okay, mama's on the K-pop board more than I am. So my mom got a K-pop red velvet key charm and I got a few crazy things. And I do want to say is I got the last Super M album from the bookstore. And it felt so damn good. <laughs> it felt so good. Like I literally picked up the album off the shelf and I thought there was more. So I started looking and there wasn't any more. It literally went straight to a whole different band. I was like, wait, what? So I grabbed it. I was like, oh my god, this other girl's in the store. I want to take it. I don't want I want to make sure no one gets it. I want it. I need it. I need it. Because I know I'm not going to be able to get it here in Canada just yet because of such recent re uh, release. So I snatched that so hard. And I went up to the cashier and it was this guy, this Adichie that was cashing. And I was like, hello. Hi, how are you? Um, I have this album, Super M, here. Is this the last one? Is there any other ones? He's like, on there. He's like, no, this is the last one. I was like, oh, last one? He said, yeah, last one. So I said, can I have it? He's like, of course you can have it. So then he peels back the new release sticker on it and he cashes me out. Literally, he just cashes me out. Being the last Super M C D group CD, I remind you, on Monday, October the 7th in Manhattan at the Quota Bookstore. Literally the last album. So it felt really, really good to know that I got that last Super M album. Um, you can probably find it at any other store, but just knowing that it was me, the last person taking that, and that morning at 10, 15 a.m., 
you guys know have no idea how much I sweated picking up all those albums. My cousin, he was just looking at me like, did I really just bring you to Manhattan to get you just keep up CDs? And I said, yeah. Huge box. Let's see if I can lift it up. Let's see if I can lift it up for you guys. Here we go. It's all in here. If you guys don't believe me. Woo! I literally put everything in here just because it's just so much so oh i have my light stick out guys because i want to take some pictures to enter the contest again let's see if i'm lucky if i am we're gonna win some merch so let's put the light stick to the side oh my k-pop oh my k-pop my bts idol um collab with mtrp um lens so i'm actually wearing these lens right now um, I thought that I needed some new lens because the ones I was using were from Japan and I ran out of a few of them. So I took a gamble and bought this on olens.com and Big Hit, of course, endorsed it. And I got a sugar card. So this is the, um, box. I'm just going to come up to the camera. I'm just going to quickly take it out. It's supposed to be this color, which is called FYI. Uh, my self gray 1D lens, they are zero, even though I do wear glasses, but I've decided to buy them in just regular, so I can see. If I want my contacts, or I mean glasses with my contacts, I'll do that. So that's something that I've got um, yesterday. So, oh, here is my Taeyong t-shirt that I am so excited to wear. I probably won't wear it yet, just because y'all know Tay 10 is my bias. Tay 10, literally. I can't get enough of Tay 10. And so I got two t-shirts, so the, the Taeyong and the 10 one. And I do say that the quality of this t-shirt is amazing. It is beyond words, better than any kind of t-shirt merch I've bought up to today from their company or in general. Like the material is very heavy. The clothing, it's worth it because it feels like you are paying for durability and you are paying for longevity like like the font is very thick that if you just stretch it i don't think it's gonna rip anytime soon so i would say that this was really a good buy um i haven't scanned the t-shirt on me yet i probably will um this is a size large that i am wearing so it goes all the way down to my elbows and it's a little bit past my butt i don't know if you guys can see that it's all the way down here so i'm just bringing it up because i don't like to have clothing that too baggy on me so that's pretty much the specs of it um yeah that's pretty much what i wanted to say super m is pretty much doing their thing and really 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 putting out some good merch for now i don't know how it's going to be in the future but yeah so let's go on guys so one of the first albums i had to get and i couldn't help but open it i opened two albums since i came back and i think i shouldn't have but i wanted to because i just wanted to do it on camera with you guys i bought the boom album so that's nct june's third mini album um it's this version here i really really wanted to buy it because i i think i saved every track off of this album and i was like if I saved every track of that album on Spotify, that must mean I really like the album. So then I bought the Boom album. The next album that I couldn't help but just open up has to be, uh, I was going to say Super Junior. But uh, it's actually Taman's album, Wanted. A want, sorry, yeah. Want, not wanted, but want. Um, I saw Taven posted a picture of him in the album and a couple of shiny albums on Insta, and I couldn't help but laugh because I literally opened the album the same day he posted, which was yesterday. So I did get myself a want album. I wanted to get his Jap album, Japanese album, just or uh, NCT's uh, Japanese album, but I knew that he didn't sell it there. So it's kind of a bummer, but I was like, it's okay, it's cool, I'll deal with it. So like I said, I seriously think... I have an issue with SM. Like everything I've owned so far or bought on this trip has to do with SM Entertainment. Oh, before I forgot, this album came with a want want entertainment poster. I haven't opened it yet. Um, it got squished a little in my suitcase. So um I left it like this in the container as I got it. And I will probably take that out and place it on my wall this is not my room i'm just literally using another room i'll probably paste into this room so yeah um 
so the next few stuff that I did grab was I needed I needed I needed a calendar um I went three years without a calendar from Korea like a Korean calendar like a k-pop one for three years and it hurts because the calendars really really do help me because I like to plan my stuff like my work schedule and all that stuff so I did get a desk one I'm not I'm the one that's not too big. I usually get the huge ones that's taller than me. So I decided to add a BTS to it, which I usually don't, even though all my calendars were BTS. So I wanted to keep the BTS line thing going for the calendars. So I got an RM's calendar. Um, it's all him in there, literally all him. Um, yeah, so I'm excited for that. Um, anything I want to add to it? No, it's just this beautiful calendar of RM. So, yeah. We'll take a look at how... See how it goes um i got nct stickers oh my gosh i got an nct sticker book because i thought i should plaster my entire freaking purse uh nct um they're really cute stickers um wavy i believe wavy is oh i just ripped it off shoot i believe wavy is involved well not involved but is part of the book um you can see some photos from the uh, cri their, their uh, party, their Christmas party, <laughs> their Halloween party. Um, here we have some picture with Dream and 127. Um, I'm trying to see if I see any wavies. It's hard to see wavy on here to be honest. Like, I felt like this was created before wavy was even debuted, which kind of sucks. Yeah, it, it does suck because look, you can see 127, NCTU, and NCT Dream. So, you most likely you're not gonna see any wavy people in here. So, no Kuhn, no Hendry. So, I'm kind of sad about that. Oh, but this picture is really cute, guys really really cute so that's my NCT sticker book which I'm looking forward to use the most um, just to jazz up my work stuff so on the note of NCT I got NCT's regular and irregular album so I literally picked this I was picking up the other one with the members faces on it um, but I didn't I don't know why why did I not pick it up oh so all they had was jungle tail one mark and one Utah and I was telling my mom I was like oh my god mom I should get Jungkook mom I should get Jungkook and she keeps yelling at me oh my god look at BTS I'm like mom shush I want to get Jungkook and she kept talking and talking and talking and she just got me cheesed and I was like you know what I'll just go with her and I'll pick up an album right afterwards so it ends up being this one I haven't opened it yet either I want to open all these with you guys on camera just so you guys can see what's in there like my card that I choose. So that's the album I got for NCT. I'm just throwing stuff. And then I got this album. If you guys don't know which one this is, this is their Limitless album. So this has all my favorite jams up in the house. Um, because Baby Don't Like It's in there, Heartbreakers in there, Good Thing, Back to You, and Angel, and Limitless. And oh yeah, all my favorite songs are in here. So I'm super stoked to open this up and see what's in it because it was so expensive. All these albums were like $33, $29, $36. They were not cheap at all. I kept the bill to tell you guys. And last but not least, the Super Am album. So here's my Super Am album that I told you guys I lastly took from the store. I don't know if you guys can see it. There we go. Ta and then you can see the price. I paid 24 bucks for that, guys. 24. I don't know if you guys can see that. Probably not a good idea, yet, but not a good idea. But it was $24 for this album. Um, and oh my gosh, we're coming down to the last bit of stuff that I purchased. And the last few things that I did purchase happens to be these. So I got some badges, they were $9.95 each, and then I got salt pocket for $9. Um, the pins that I got has to be Icon. I got it because I'm still grieving over the handbin thing. And I wanted to support handbin regardless of what happened. It sucks that the way things are happening at YG. But I had to, had to, had to get myself an Icon badge to support them. Then I had to get an NCT badge because y'all know your girl is just NCT'd. 
to the max. Like that's just where I'm at right now. And then I got a Monstax metal badge. I'm still waiting for Monstax to come to Toronto. Like it's crazy. Like it's been how many months and I'm just waiting. I'm like, so y'all went went world tour, right? Okay, so when y'all plan to come to Toronto again? Like you guys promised to come world tour, which is Canada too, right? So I did get a Monstax cute little pen badge and last but not least i got a chimmy i got a little cute little chimmy um plug pop it just because i want i got a new cell phone and i wanted to put him on there so guys that's what i've gotten so far and it's just a lot of stuff to unpack i don't know how i came through immigration with all of this because immigration was like miss miss shannon um I see you spent $200, what'd you buy? I literally opened my bag and I was like, K-pop albums. She's like, what? I'm like, K-pop albums. You know BTS? She's like, yeah. I'm like, yeah. That's where I found my money. So guys, that's a wrap on my rundown of K-pop albums, of sharing, of things I've gotten. And I'm so happy to be with you guys again in another video. And I'm hoping to see you guys again with more questions, answers, any merch, any concert that's coming up. And we'll stay tuned in the know-how. So thank you again, my K Dreamers, and all of you guys who are watching, who may not be subscribed, who's just passing by, liking and commenting. You guys are awesome. See you guys soon. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please, as we go through the following safety instructions. Thank you and enjoy your flight. Ew.